வெல்கம் டு தய கெமிஸ்ட்ரி யூடியூப் சேனல் கர்நாடகா டூ தௌசண்ட் தேர்ட்டீன் பார்ட் ஃபைவ் கொஷின் நம்பர் ஃபார்ட்டி ஒன் எ சப்ஸ்டன்ஸ் விச் டெஸ்ட்ராய்ஸ் த ஆக்டிவிட்டி ஆஃப் எ கேட்டலிஸ்ட் இஸ் கால்ட் த சப்ஸ்டன்ஸ் டஸ் டெஸ்ட்ராய் த ஆக்டிவிட்டி ஆஃப் கேட்டலிஸ்ட் பை த பர்சன்ஸ் ஆர் நோன் அஸ் கேட்டலைட்டிக் பாய்சன் ஹென்ஸ் ஆப்ஷன் டி இஸ் கரெக்ட் ப்ரொமோட்டர் ப்ரொமோட்டர் விச் ப்ரொமோட்ஸ் த catalytic activity hence it was not correct inhibitor inhibitor also enhances the catalytic activity it was not correct uh, among option c and d it was not a negative catalyst there is a difference between negative catalyst and the catalytic poison for example let us take platinum catalyst is used in the oxidation of hydrogen it was poisoned by carbon monoxide Hence, this carbon monoxide was not a negative catalyst, it is a catalytic poison. Hence, the substance which destroys the activity of a catalyst is called as catalytic poison. Question number 42. The average bond energy of S8, so sulfur, hydrogen and H2S are given. Three values have been given respectively. The enthalpy of the following reaction. take this from this equation the bond energy of the reactant s8 and plus 8 h2 minus bond energy of the product delta h was given as bond energy of reactant minus product so let us take bond energy of s8 from equation bond energy of s8 reactant is 264 plus 8 into h2 8 into 436 the bond energy of h2 minus 8 into h2s 8 into h2s that is 338 which gives 1048 kJ per mole option c is correct question number 43 match the following spectroscopic technique with the regions in the electromagnetic spectrum vibrational spectroscopy is ir electronic spectroscopy which related to ultraviolet and visible region mass bayer spectroscopy which was related to gamma radiation and nmr spectroscopy we use radio waves radio frequency region hence it is option A is correct. Among the following diatomic molecules, which one shows EPR signal? Here, lithium. Lithium will not show EPR signal. Carbon does not show EPR signal because it, this both does not contain an unpaired electron. Nitrogen is a N, triple bond N. This was not also shows any EPR. Uh, EPR signal whereas boron it contains uh, two unpaired electron it shows EPR signal boron is a electron deficient compound this shows boron shows EPR signal question number 45 among the singlet doublet and triplet electronic states phosphorescence involved in the transition between here in jablonski diagram you observe the electron moves towards to a higher energy level and by internal conversion it comes to the ground state it returns to the ground state and this s1 this singlet state s1 singlet higher energy state to singlet the ground state is called fluorescence is called fluorescence that is fluorescence is from s1 to s0 whereas intersystem crossing if you take uh, if a electron goes from singlet to triplet state it is called intersystem uh, crossing that is isc this intersystem crossing here it was shown intersystem crossing 
goes to triplet state is say t1 and from triplet state t1 to ground state singlet state it was known as phosphorescence phosphorescence is t1 to s is zero hence option c is correct singlet to triplet state transition between singlet to singlet state is a uh, uh, fluorescence so option a is wrong not a doublet state doublet state was not involved here triplet to triplet was not involved here so phosphorescence is transition between singlet to triplet state option c is correct question number 46 the number of normal modes of vibration of carbon dioxide water and acetylene is carbon dioxide is a linear molecule it's a for linear it's a 3n minus 5 in carbon dioxide there are three molecule three atoms so 3 into 3 minus 5 which is 4 carbon dioxide shows so four modes of vibration h2o it's a non-linear molecule it's a 3n minus 6 3 into 3 minus 6 that is which is 3 H2O shows three modes of vibration. Whereas in acetylene, it's a linear molecule. Acetylene is a linear 3n minus 5. N is there are four uh, number of atoms. So 3n minus 5, 3 into 4 minus 5, which is equal to 7. Hence 4, 3, 7 is the correct answer. 4, 3, 7. Option B is correct. Question number 47 of the three types of systematic errors encountered in a chemical analysis which is most difficult to identify to correct. Instrumental error, methodic error, personal error all are equal to all are e difficult to identify which is the correct answer. See instrumental error, methodic error and personal errors. Methodic errors are due to no ideal physical or chemical behavior completeness and the speed of the reaction interfering side reactions sampling problems can be <coughs> corrected with a proper method development errors inherent in a method errors are often difficult to detect and hence these errors are usually most difficult to identify and correct among this instrumental error can be identified easily personal error can also be identified easily hence option b this methodic error cannot be identified easily because due to following the wrong method you can't identify hence option b is correct match the following a low accuracy low accuracy low precision you see in circle in here there was only one dot percent accuracy is less and precision is less b b is high accuracy but low precision here there are four dots accuracy is greater but precision is less c c is low accuracy high precision you see here there was no dot hence accuracy is very low and the precision is greater in option d high accuracy high precision hence option d is correct question number 49 which type of error affect the result of a series of determinations to the same degree is determinate error Question number 50, the analysis of the sample in ion or gives the values, they are given the uh, values, what will be the mean and the standard deviation for the following. First mean is 71, uh, 7.13, so mean value is uh, 7.13, now, 10 values are given, hence you have to calculate that. Uh, standard deviation the standard deviation uh, formula is x minus x square whole square by n minus 1 the standard deviation value is 0 
option C is correct. With this, Karnataka set 2013 question and answers comes to an end. Thank you for watching. Thank you. We will meet in Karnataka set paper 3 chemical science.